We're helping you get ready for another round of wild weather here. Yeah, Casey Baylor is live with that. And what should people do today, Casey? Eugene, Bethany, here are some three easy steps you can do before you head out to go to work this morning. First thing is you want to make sure your phone, your charge, your, uh, your battery banks, I should say, make sure they're charged just in case you lose power throughout the day. Another thing is if today's not trash day for you, you might want to take your trash can and bring it inside. Of course, it's one of those things want to get blown away out in a storm. And then another most important thing for you to do is have a plan of what to expect and what you should do when this storm comes rolling your way. Now, grocery shopping might not be the best option for you uh, in a storm, but when you get off work later today, make sure you get all of your evening plans out of the way early. Try to bring any items inside. Like I said, trash can, you're talking patio furniture, grills. Make sure you bring those out inside um, so they don't uh, get blown away. Way. And if there's time, try and trim some branches that could fall on your home and move your car if it's parked under a tree. Now, with the threat of hail, it might be best to just move it inside a garage. And another thing most important that a lot of people are stressing is make sure you know what's going on in your area and make sure that you have severe weather app, um, severe weather alerts to keep you posted on what's happening throughout the day. For live here in Norfolk, I'm Casey Baylor for 13 News Now. All right, Casey, thank you. So let's talk about the difference between a watch and a warning. A watch means conditions are favorable for severe weather. In other words, the atmosphere is ready and severe weather could happen. Now, when a warning is issued, it's time to go and take cover. It means a storm has been spotted or detected by radar. Make the most of the 13 News Now app today and turn on your location and enable notifications. That way we can alert you to severe weather no matter where you are.